Hey everyone, today I've got some exciting news out of China that could revolutionize the world of nuclear energy. China has reportedly made a significant breakthrough with its Thorium Molten Salt Reactor or TMSR, located in the Gobi Desert city of Wuwei. This reactor is not your typical nuclear power plant. Instead of using solid fuel rods and water for cooling, this experimental design uses liquid fluoride salts mixed with thorium, and it operates at much higher temperatures but much lower pressures than traditional reactors. So, what makes this so revolutionary? One of the most intriguing aspects of the TMSR is its potential to refuel itself. Here's how it works. Thorium, when bombarded with neutrons inside the reactor core, transforms into uranium-233. This uranium-233 is fissile, meaning it can sustain a nuclear chain reaction. Theoretically, this process could allow the reactor to operate continuously for decades or even centuries without needing to shut down for refueling. Yes, you heard that right. Decades or centuries of continuous operation. This is a game changer in terms of energy production efficiency and cost effectiveness. Safety is another major advantage of the TMSR design. Because it operates at atmospheric pressure, there's no risk of explosive pressure buildups like in water-cooled reactors. Plus, the molten salt fuel has built-in safety features. If the reactor overheats, a plug melts, allowing the salt mixture to drain into secure containment tanks where the reaction naturally stops and the salt solidifies, safely containing any radioactive materials. Also, TMSRs produce significantly less long-lived radioactive waste compared to uranium reactors, and the waste they do produce is less suitable for weaponization. Another significant benefit is that this design doesn't need large quantities of water for cooling, making it perfect for arid regions like the Gobi Desert. And let's talk about thorium itself. It's much more abundant in the Earth's crust than uranium, providing a vast and largely untapped resource. China, with its significant thorium reserves, is positioning itself to potentially lead in this next-generation nuclear technology. Now, this initial reactor is a small-scale experimental prototype designed to produce 2 megawatts of thermal energy, but its successful operation and demonstration of self-refueling capabilities mark a critical step forward. Of course, there are engineering challenges ahead, especially with scaling up this technology and dealing with the corrosive nature of molten salts, but if China can overcome these hurdles, it could revolutionize the global energy sector. Imagine, a powerful tool in the fight against climate change and a secure source of long-term energy independence. This development represents a potential paradigm shift in nuclear power generation, moving us away from decades-old technology towards a safer and more sustainable future. So, keep an eye on this space. The future of energy might just be unfolding in the deserts of China right now. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to support the channel by checking out our official store. Your support helps us keep going and bring you even more great content. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.